so you know through your studies you're really becoming a resource to other people mm. you know what I mean and this is not just a journey of personal growth and development but you are becoming a resource and a reference for others not just in your family but also in your community <laughs> because the average person is not dedicating time like this to really learn about themselves mm. that's a fact you know what I mean that's a fact and because of that, you're growing at an exponential rate in comparison to the average person that's your age. You know, the things that you're thinking about right now at your age, some people may never think about that their whole entire life. Hmm. Or hmm. they may start thinking about it when they get into their 40s or 50s. When it's too late. Hmm. Yeah. You're actually considering some of these things right now in regard to your personal growth and development. The average person, they may think about these things if they're enrolled in college because, you know, okay. So they may only think about it in that way because they're in college and they want to have a career. What do you mean? That is the only what kind of, okay. that's the only kind of growth that they're thinking about. Mm. Going to school, getting the education and getting a good job or whatever. Or they may be working and they're only thinking about growth in terms of getting a raise or whatever at their job. They're not thinking about personal growth and development when it comes to knowledge of self. That don't got nothing to do with being in college or nothing to do with being on a job. It enhances what you're doing in college and it enhances what you're doing on a job. But this is an independent study that most people don't undertake. Mm. They're not dedicating no time to read books or to study or to research, finding things out about themselves like that. They're not doing that. So that automatically makes you grow at a rate that other people are not growing in because you're deliberate about it. They're not even thinking about this. So because of that, you expanding and increasing your knowledge, you have the potential to become wiser. So you think about it, knowledge, wisdom, and understanding the more you establish this foundation in terms of expanding your awareness and being more conscious and learning more and gaining more knowledge, your foundation expands. So the more knowledge that you have, the more potential you have to be wiser. Because if you don't know shit, you're not going to be making the wise decisions. It's just that simple. The more you know, the more potential you are, the more potential you have to be wiser. So then, the more people know how wise you are, naturally they're gonna come to you for advice or information or resources or whatever. You become more of that person in your family and then also in your community. And then also with knowledge and wisdom, what does knowledge and wisdom bore? Understanding. You become more understanding. So people are still gonna be coming to you for advice and everything else because you're more understanding than the average person <laughs> you know so that becomes more of your responsibility if mega did this, if mega did this.